We're in for a Friday night special as the Swans kick off your weekend with a blockbuster showdown against Hawthorne at the SCG. Sydney will be chasing a third straight victory heading into the bye after edging the Saints in another tight affair, again proving their composure under pressure. We've won some, uh, some really tight ones. We've lost a couple. If you're in it up until the last minute or two minutes of the game, that's where you want to be. Uh, you don't want to be sitting there you know, halfway through the last quarter saying no chance to having a, having a win. You want to be in it right up to your eyeballs, right to the last minute. And, um, and we've been able to do that, and that's not an easy thing to do. The Swan stocks are set to receive a boost after the bye as Errol Goulden, Braden Campbell and Lewis Melican track well in their recovery from injury. Lewis Melican's coming along well. Uh, he's running as a result of his recurrent hamstring strain. We expect him to be available after the bye. Errol's going well with his rehabilitation. Uh, he's back in football boots, doing some change of direction running, um, getting some good kilometres into his legs, so we hope that he's going to be available after the bye as well. Braden started uh, some running this week. He's still on the Ultra G. We expect him to have a uh, slow and steady progress with his running program. It's been a huge week for the Swans with co-captain Josh Kennedy signing on until at least the end of 2022. The 34-year-old midfielder credits the club's younger players for his longevity as he looks to becoming one of the few to play 300 games at the Swans. Uh, yeah, it's a beauty, I think, of being involved in a footy club. I think you're sort of eternally just stuck around that 25 age bracket. Um, I think when you first come into the, into the club, you've, you're forced to especially coming up to Sydney if you've come from interstate you're forced to grow up pretty quickly and, and uh, fend for yourself and learn very quickly what it takes to be a, a professional athlete um, and make a lot of sacrifices uh, and then when you get to the end that I'm at now you sort of got to try and keep up keep up with the new fads and the new phases um, which has been fun too but they are it's just I really enjoy a great group of players great group of guys that really enjoy each other's company and uh, I'm happy to come along for the ride. Don't forget to jump online and grab your tickets to this Friday night showdown at the SCG as the Swans add another chapter in our long-standing rivalry against Hawthorne.